Don't strip the talent? Yeah. 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 My hair gets nervous. Hello, welcome to the Misty West review of the Dyson Airwrap. My name is Madison and I am the graphic designer and content creator for Misty West. Before I start, I would like to tell you a little bit about who Misty West is and what we do. We are a research and engineering consultancy based in Vancouver, BC, who specializes in early stage product development and prototyping. Our team likes to hardware hack and tear things apart, and we already have a couple things on our blog, like a teardown of a simple human soap dispenser and a Sensirion sensor. While this video will include a design review followed by a demo of the air wrap, we won't include a teardown of the air wrap, but we will be following up with a separate post dedicated to a teardown. The idea of this video originated strictly out of self-interest when I saw a targeted ad for the Dyson air wrap on Pinterest. As a curly haired person, I am constantly searching for guidance on what to do with my hair and when I graced upon the Dyson Airwrap and saw an image of a woman straightening her hair without heat, I knew I needed to bring this into my life. I convinced the team to let me purchase the Airwrap for science on the condition that we do a technical report on it and that my colleague Phil gets to do a teardown on it after we're finished. I've since tried the Airwrap on my hair and I'm going to take my newfound knowledge and share with you in this video how to take curly hair and create Lana Del Rey inspired waves. This is going to be a completely 100% unbiased and unsponsored review. Let's talk about the price. Every review that I've read online says that the air wrap is $550. That is in US dollars. We are in Canada. In Canadian dollars, after tax, the Dyson air wrap is $784. When I asked my colleagues to guess how much the air wrap costs, and I revealed it to them after they had guessed way under, all of their reactions were along the lines of and are you me? There's a lot of other things that you could buy for $784. You could get a 98 Honda Civic from Craigslist, half of your month's rent for a one bedroom apartment here in Vancouver, a plane ticket to Ecuador, this giant 3D printer thing that my roommate bought. Are women really gonna spend that much money on a blow dryer? It's not a blow dryer, you guys. It is a complete styling tool that dries your hair as it styles it. It's designed to eliminate a step of hair styling and saves you time. The reality is is for a Dyson fan, you know it's going to cost that much. Dyson's market research team had it figured out when they started making hair styling tools a few years ago, when women were already spending $400 USD on blow dryers, and that was before Dyson's supersonic hair dryer entered the market. The air wrap harnesses the Kawanda effect. If you don't know what the Kawanda effect is, it's named after Henry Kawanda and is basically what makes airplanes fly. The Kawanda effect is a phenomenon where the jet flow of a fluid or gas over a convex surface will stay attached to the surface even if it curves away from the initial jet direction. You can actually test this phenomenon at home by holding up the convex side of a spoon under a running tap of water and watching as the water drips over the edge of the spoon and comes off in the direction of the water flow. The air wrap has six slots around its curling tools that allow the jet stream to come out and create a spinning vortex around the curling barrel. You need to have damp hair for this tool to work because when hair is wet the hydrogen bonds are broken and can be reformed until the hair is dry. Dyson says that it measures the airflow temperature over 40 times a second to make sure that the heat of the air wrap stays below 150 degrees Celsius. It would be great if physicists could find a way to bend hair bonds without using heat, but I guess science isn't quite there yet. As far as the industrial design of the air wrap goes, it is sleek and sexy, but it is also a beast. Dyson's V9 digital motor is at the base of the wand, keeping it a little bit more lightweight and easy to use, and a better distribution of weight, which is good because once you attach one of the paddle brush attachments, this thing gets pretty large and awkward. At the very least, I expected the wand to have metal parts. Even the leather carrying case that the air wrap comes in isn't even made of real leather, and it doesn't have a handle or anything, so it makes kind of carrying it a pain in the ass. This is where my initial vision of, wow, this is the styling tool to end all other styling tools, slowly shifts into, 
What was the other thing, Denise? Like slowly hey, shifts Dyson into. Hey, Dyson doesn't want to make hey, the perfect tool. Dyson doesn't want to make the perfect tool because then you'd never need to buy a second one. When I tried the Dyson at home, I used the highest temperature setting with the firm brush attachment. It took me about 40 minutes to do my hair, and let me remind you that is when starting with wet hair. So that is actually very fast. Since this is the method that I've had the most practice with, it is what I'm going to be demoing for you today. I think this concludes the design review portion of our video, and we can now move on to the demo. Walker, would you like to take a seat? All right, let's do this. I'm just gonna section the crap with your head. Uh, you're not concerned about breakage or anything, are you? No, I don't know what that is. No. Is it too hot? Nope. More heat. Yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, it's working. Yeah, it actually is. Nice. And so the hairspray is going to keep it from uh, like returning back to its right Oh yeah. Ooh, peachy oh, waves. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me know if I'm bringing you. Like, we'll see how this looks at the end. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we could collect all oh, the hairs off yeah. of it and maybe donate it. Make like. a hat. <laughs> yeah. So we uh, used the little Dyson air wrap unit thing and uh, it's pretty good. It only took about 45 minutes. I haven't actually seen my hair yet, but the way that everybody's laughing at me, uh, <laughs> I would rate it as a positive experience. Is it worth uh, $784? No, I don't have that much money. For $784, including tax, I could buy a quarter of a new mountain bike. I could buy yeah. an eighth of a Bitcoin. Yeah. yeah. Yay! concludes Misty West's review and demo of the Dyson Airwrap. We hope to have more YouTube content for you in the near future, so please subscribe to our channel. If you have any suggestions for other items you'd like us to review, please leave a comment below. Thank you for watching.